I think this is pretty much the end of the game, right? Like, did this have a Kickstarter? I remember it had promotional material like a year ago. Are there good amusement parts? Amusement? Yeah. Sorry. Ah. Amusement. It would be parts. cool if this had a soundtrack that slowed down and sped up, like like uh, that Jonathan Blow game. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. No, although it wouldn't make as much sense. But mm. still. Yeah, I like Natalie Portman. Ow! <laughs> One more time. I shoot you, I shoot you, and then I'm gonna shoot you and take your gun. One more time, we're here to celebrate. Oh, oh yeah, all oh, night I'm to celebrate. One more time, we're gonna celebrate. Oh yeah. Ah, one more time. Fuck! I couldn't tell where you're gonna be. I, I, I didn't. I, I didn't know that the the outer limits did the Terminator movie first. I'm sorry. What? I didn't know that. We shot each other's bullets. That was cool. Yes, I do consider myself a katana wielding alpha male in bed, but you spelled katana wrong. That's how much of a neckbeard I am. Ah, fuck! I had no opportunity there! Katana. I hate, you know what I hate actually? A mechanic in this game that I think would have worked much better. Um, so basically, here I'll show you. So when you, um, when you pick up something and throw it, right? Yeah. Time goes forward, like, as much as how much it, it you threw it. Also, when you shoot, time goes forward for like you shooting, right? So I can I can like shoot and time goes forward instantly. But the issue with that is like of of it happening right away while as soon as you press it, press the button. The issue with that is that it gives you no opportunity to move. So if it's like if if this guy's about to shoot me and I'm like I throw something, then the bullet comes right at my head. Whereas realistically. I mean, not realistically, but in, in I, I think it would be a would have been a better mechanic if, let's say, when you press the throw button, it starts like you can see your hand kind of like almost throw the gun. Like instead of it going this far in a second, it should just have you like it barely leaving your your fingers, and then as you move, then the gun starts moving forward too. Because otherwise, it it completely um, gets rid of any opportunity for you to skillfully dodge their bullet and throw at the same time, you know? Like, you can't... It, it it immediately just makes time move forward before you can even do that. So that kind of upsetting, but whatever. Okay. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about, but I feel like that is... No, I do, and it's, uh, you're can... right. Because logically, that's how it should work. But yeah, I don't like, like... I don't like the time jumping for forward right away, because it puts you at a disadvantage. They might have done that because somebody complained that fuck throwing guns sucks. And then they might have done that because, like, as a way to make sure people knew that their action registered. You know, but I feel like there could have been a way to do it either way. I don't. I don't feel like this had to have been how it was done. Have you seen Fish Tank? Yes. You know what? I, I think. I think that Fish Tank, like, that's a movie that I could put at the bottom of my 2009 list for me thinking, like, yeah, it was pretty good. You know what's, so, um, when I wind up, uh, watching a lot of my, uh, um, uh, top ten list movies, fuck! A lot of those things for my list, and I'm just literally just, uh, plowing through them, um, and watching as many as I can within short amounts of time. Um... One thing that I do is, like, if I feel... If I'm watching a movie, I'm like, well, this doesn't look like it's going anywhere, or, or, um... Or, like, it doesn't seem... Like, even if it's, like, all right, it doesn't seem like it's gonna go anywhere, I'll just... I'll give it... I'll give it as much of a chance as I think it deserves, and then... And then I'll just skip through it. And, you know, just skip through the rest of the movie to see if, like something changes and it turns out 
that, you know, if I'm worried that it's gonna be the same and, like, predictable and and just stay in the same pattern of what I think it's gonna be, um, then I sometimes just give up. Fish Tank was one of those movies where, um, I think I got about, like, I think I got a legitimate halfway through the movie, so it's not like I gave up early or anything. Um, I got about halfway through the movie, and, and then I started skipping through it, and one of the only times where this has happened is what I saw while skipping through it was interesting enough and, like, intrigued me enough that I was like, oh, fuck it, well, shit actually does happen, and then I went back to where I, where I left off and continued watching, and it turned out to be a pretty good movie. That's, like, one of the only times this happened. You know, usually, usually if I give up on a movie, it's because it's kind of bad and... Ah! This one's so hard. This one's so super hot. Ah, this seems like a better approach, honestly. I don't know why I wasn't doing this before. Ah! See, even picking up, even picking up weapons, it jumps time forward like an entire like two seconds. Yeah, it? because it's the consequence. It's just, I don't like that. I wish, I wish that it still only happened as I moved forward. Um, if I had a death note. Um, Onision, uh, just end his, it's not, not, it's a pity That's kill. That's really funny. It's a pity kill. <laughs> I, I'm just ending his suffering. Wow. Really, come on. He's a suffering boy. He's, wow. He's, he's not right in the head. It's that like, could be considered as, like, a death threat. No! I, You're saying if you had a tool to kill him in which you... It's a hypothetical! <laughs> He's yeah, a, I know, he's, you're saying if I a, could get away a, with killing him, I would. Adam, he's a rabid dog. <laughs> he's, a, he's a sick dog in the head. He's a, he's a dog that needs to be taken out back. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Jesus, Mark. <laughs> <laughs> he's a sick pup. You know what we do to sick... You know what we do to the poodles around here, Adam? <laughs> <laughs> Ryan will doodle the poodle. You know what we do when poodles don't listen? Uh, would you kill o Oh, somebody just asked. Like, actually kill Onis- No, I'm not- See, I don't know what I'd do with the Death Note, because- Ah, oh, fuck! Picking I up weapons makes me get shot in the back. I hate that. It doesn't- Well, it- I wish I could vulnerable. move forward as I'm picking it up. So- You know, I feel like I should be able to do that. That's pissing me off. Like, that's one mechanic that I just feel does not yeah, work okay. well. Yeah, uh, Ow! So, if I have the Death Note, I don't know what I'd do, because I'm not a fucking, um... I would definitely use it for political purposes. See, taking a life actually would... means something to me. <laughs> well, yeah, I know, but I feel like I feel like there are uh, uh, people making corporate decisions that are literally destroying the planet, and that I would literally be saving the world by by taking out specific people that were. Uh, you know, you, you know, um, just any, any, uh, corporate interest that stunts actual progress, you know, like lobbyists that will pay to keep other competition down, I fucking hate that. And that's, and that's part of what really fucks up society. Monsanto? Sorry? Would you start there? I don't know. I don't know how bad Monsanto is. There's a lot of like, oh, what the hell? There's so much conflicting information. Um, no, I wouldn't say Trump. Trump wouldn't be first on my Trump list is, at all. He's um, small fries. Yeah, he's, he's, people over-exaggerate how dangerous Trump potatoes. is. He's a bad decision. Don't get me wrong. But yeah, people he's think not that like the, Trump the is Hitler like comparison. The I'm not sure how accurate that is. So and I don't think he would have that much power as the president anyway. Like he's not, he's not going to be a dictator because he can't do that the way that the system is set up. Like, the president doesn't have unlimited power.
Oh fuck! Um but well let me think of a good example then because if I if there there are companies that are literally just willingly Watch destroying out, the environment and you know like the companies responsible for shit like the Flint Michigan water crisis or like the slave child labor and from Nestle and um you know how like I I feel like I feel like if in the rules of of Death Note of if people were like, oh wow, suddenly all these people who have this exact same, who are doing all the, these really immoral things are suddenly just getting heart attacks and dying around the world. You'd think that it would become such a major news event that pe that it would literally, you'd only have to kill so many before, before people were like, like the heads of corporations got so scared that they just wouldn't do immoral things anymore. You know, well, I feel like I feel like it would be irresponsible not to. Company? Sorry. Hmm? Do you think killing somebody ends a company? No. It kill whoever made the decision in that company to do that. If you if you killed if let's what, say you kill them to send a message, or something. Yeah, you kill you kill whoever was responsible for that that decision. I feel like it, in the long run it would be irresponsible and unethical not to do that. Quite honestly, it like sounds terrible, but I mean there are people that are literally making the planet not just like oh it's a they're making the planet undesirable they're literally just destroying the planet so i mean they're killing me slower they're killing everybody else slower they're still killing you you know i don't think it's i don't think it's like I, obviously i'm i would never kill anybody but in the hypothetical scenario of a death note existing that pretty much waves any consequence, you know. Well, that's the whole. That's the whole point of the Death Note. That's the reason why the no. show's so good, is because it does put people into that perspective of like, if I never had to witness it or live with the consequence of it, are there people that the world would be a better place uh, without? Oh fuck! I feel like I feel like there is the opportunity to actually do good with the death note. And I wouldn't I wouldn't be like light and then just use it for my own personal vendettas and my ego. I wouldn't it wouldn't be for the purpose of like being this Kira celeb celebrity that wound up consuming him in an egotistical sort of uh pedestal way, you know? Like that's that's part of what happened to him in his character. Um but it's it's funny to think that like how far would it go though? Like you, because I'm wondering like was it the problem would solve it... itself after a while? The problem would solve itself. You no, can't... I'm saying with like on a personal level, like you you're you're given the power to kill anyone. Yes. You say right now, oh, I'll only kill these people who are committing I, these yeah, horrendous I, crimes. I, well, I'm well, then, that's the thing. Do, it's not where does it start and where see, does it stop? See, I disagree. I disagree with with Light's approach. Because the judicial system is not perfect. He's he's basing it on, like, a reporting. He's basing it, like, he's... And I, I also don't agree with this, this, the idea of vengeance. You know, I don't, I don't agree with the... Like, if, if I were to use the death note on people, it wouldn't be for... It wouldn't be like, oh, they deserve it. It would be, I'm trying to actively stop them from destroying the fucking planet because they are doing so as they are alive. So, here's the thing. I'm trying to, like, it would be an attempt to save people. With the Death Note, you can control their actions and then kill them. Oh, yeah. So, would, wouldn't you, so would you give I them a violent a death, things. or Sorry? would you give them, like, a peaceful death? I don't know. Like, what do you mean? Oh, yeah, it would always be a peaceful them? death. But considering um, that it would uh, control their actions before they die... That would actually, I, I, for, I completely forgot about that, so I'm really excited to watch the show again, because I, I completely even forgot about that aspect. I think, um, unfortunately, they're kind of like, almost zombie-like when they're in... Which is funny, yeah. uh, but I feel like, with that in mind, I could have them donate all their money to charity before they die. That'd be, like, double whammy, you know? 
Like, I can have them donate all their money to, like... I'd have not donate, but invest in, uh, something. Because if they give their money to charity, there's not always a chance that that's gonna actually... Well, yeah, I know, like, a trustworthy, dependable charity. Yeah. Or, like, environment conservation, or... Yes. Or, you know, something... Literally investing their money in the right places. That's, yeah, exactly. That's I feel like... I feel like this is a possibility. Damn it. But how do you feel about, say... Actually, no, I'm not gonna ask that Oh, question. fuck! This sucks, man. This sucks. Um... Well, yeah, I mean, like... If you... If you... I don't know why Light never did that. What? Targeted, like, immoral billionaires based on his character. You would think that he would be like, like, that he would do it in a greedy and unethical way, obviously. But you would think that he would at least remember that they exist, you know? And, and be like, like, oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna mind control these billionaires into, like, giving their money to one of my friends or something like that, that seems like something he would do and then he would use it for his own personal power and justify it being like oh this money is going to help me fund my uh protection against the fbi or something like whatever's happening you know yeah. i feel um, like i feel like he would justify it even though that's not something he's i would do sociopathic but... yeah exactly that's he, part of his character is that he's kind of a sociopath call him a hero and i don't think they get the point of death note um but uh yeah, I mean, if I had a Death Note, and I'm I'm struggling to think of a really good example, but I know that there are really uh really good examples of of corporations that are literally just so so. Let's say let's say a lobbyist um gives let's let's say uh, a lobbyist gives money to uh, get rid of protections for citizens and give extra protections to corporations and not just on like a really vague level like that but on a level where it's like man I know that there's some good examples somewhere and I'm like as I'm playing this game I'm struggling to come up with them um oh fuck um I don't want to say Monsanto because I'm really I'm trying to figure out how much of the Monsanto hate is accurate. Um, I shouldn't go here. Oh! This stinks, man. Oh, how did I not dodge that? How did I not dodge that? Oh my god. Um So like people responsible for covering up molestation in the Catholic Church or something. Mm. Like that's not I know that's not the corporate stuff I was talking about, but that's that's something that I I feel, you know, if somebody has like a pedophile ring that they're at, like it's not about people who are in jail for it. That's that's why I hate light for it is because he was targeting people who are currently serving their punishments for their crimes. And he was saying, no, it's not enough that they're being punished. You have to die for it? I think that's fucking stupid. Because a lot of, to a lot of them, dying is the easy way out anyway. Um, and I would, I would literally only target people who are a direct threat to others currently. Um, and it would only be major, major, uh, you know, kind of globally affected Right. Okay. Um. Oh fuck. Thoughts on Game Grumps? They're all right. Oh yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't do it to Martin Shkreli because I think there's some misinformation about him too. I don't like. I don't understand the economics of of pharmaceuticals well enough to be able to make a decision like that. Like I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't do it on anything that I didn't completely understand. I would treat it very responsibly. And I know we're talking about, like, killing other human beings. Well, Dexter, it's different for him because he was kind of, like, Dexter was gonna kill regardless. 
It's just... Yeah, Dexter got off on it, didn't he? Isn't that his character? Well, I don't, well, I guess in a way, yeah, he kind of got off on it. It's just his thing. He, like, needs to kill. Oh, fuck. He's gonna kill regardless. Might as well steer him in the right direction. Um, then again... Oh, this, no! This, despite everything, that... that May, you being the wielder of uh, Death Note, Dexter, they're still killers. And I'm not saying everything's black and white, but what they're doing isn't right regardless. Anyone who wields Death Note and uses it... Yeah, I wouldn't go morally... after, like... I wouldn't go after, like, individual crimes like murders or anything because well, I'm there's no it way to... It doesn't matter. You've killed someone. It's, it's, uh... There's, there's no... It, it's a moral gray area for sure, but you... You committed a crime yourself. A crime against a human being. Regardless of what they've done, you've taken it upon themselves, vigilante style, a weird to end their choice. life. Oh fuck! Damn it! It's just I sometimes I I dislike how quick people are to jump to uh, taking someone's life. It's just all right, well, I mean, so on certain variables, it's uh, if self-defense is even self-defense is a very like shady, gray area. It's true that you have the ap you have the absolutely the right to like to stop somebody from taking your life. So, so if so, basically, what I'm saying is that I would only use it in a way that's a larger scale equivalency to yeah. literally like. ISIS terrorists are in the hotel and they're literally gonna kill everybody in front of you So what do you do if you have a gun you're gonna shoot them? That's it's a it's a larger scale equivalency of People are dying, you know, and I'm trying to stop people from dying by killing the people killing them It's it's a it's a larger scale version of oh my god There's terrorists and they're about to kill everybody in in the room. So you pick up a gun and shoot them Right that's it's it's like it's like a even that, like, I don't know, if the terrorists are, let, let's say the terrorist is only going to kill one person and it's not you, and it's like, oh, it's technically not self-defense, but you saved a life. That's, that's how I'm viewing it anyway. <laughs> what? I don't, like, it's a, it's a larger scale version of the exact same thing. I would only, I would only use it in that manner. But Adam, I wouldn't, I wouldn't use it. don't you realize we needed 9-11? Fuck. Sorry? <laughs> Sorry. Uh... Self-defense always comes back to fight you in the ass, though, says Mega Salami. Um, Mark, what do you think about the Syrian refugees in Canada? I don't know. They were, like, half of the hotel at the furry convention, and I, we didn't have any issues with them. Yeah. I saw some in the elevator. It's the refugees, at the end of the day. It's, yeah, I mean, they, it's they not, like, I don't know, it's country. not really their fault. A lot, of, a lot of people's fears are that they're, like, soldiers in hiding and shit. Which... Some of them might be, right? It's possible. I'd like it if they did some thorough screening, I guess. But well, yeah, like we're we're assuming that thorough screening is taking place. Um. Oh no, he shot my bullet or something. I don't know how that happened. I've seen you do that exact maneuver a lot of times. And it just like it never works out, way, and I'm yeah. just I know. I'm slowly getting a better approach every time. I just need to know. Mark, do all Canadians have to drink maple syrup every day? Yeah, I haven't had mine yet, and I've already got the shakes. Um, Fuck. See, it traps me. I can't start moving. I guess I maybe. No, I can't really. Fuck. Yeah, I think I think it's. I think the reception to the Syrian refugees is ridiculous. Yeah, it depends on the context. Because if we're talking about. Like the individuals who had a rape party in in Cologne, then obviously yeah. you can't really defend that. No, you can't. Um, I'm still, I'm still, I'm trying to think of a specific example where I would use the death note for like the head of a corporation or a CEO of a corporation. I'd, I'd use it on all cis white males because they have oh, me systematic too. power. And, I, and by ending their it's lives, not murder it's if actually yeah, it's not murder if they're not real human beings. Murder equals power plus privilege plus murder. <laughs> it's terrible that like somebody would answer that. 
way. It's, it's terrible that people like that seriously exist. It's yes, so fucked it up. Is. It's, uh, it's, and, and, and it's Oh, I didn't even know he was shooting me there! To use it as an example, to explain to this person why that's wrong, you'd be like, that's like you saying, uh, um, I'll murder all black people, then the world will be better. And they go, no, see, that's racism. What I'm doing isn't racism. Or hate, Fuck. or like, isn't right, like, is completely right. Have I seen Chef? Not really interested. No. Uh, not very interested. In, in fact, like... Fuck you! Thank you. I've only I've only seen one or two good movies that had to do with food, and was quite good. As a fan of food... As a fan of... Two girls, one cuck? Yep. Um... If you make uh, a contract to become a magical girl, what would you wish for? What? I don't even understand that question. A contract? What? Feminist gets death note. Writes all males. <laughs> That's so funny. But it has to be individuals, and you have to be picturing them in your head. Yeah, exactly. Uh, would Adam kill uh, Kim Jong? -un? Oh fuck! They come so fast. Like, I cleared everybody behind me, and then all of a sudden I got shot in the back. I don't get that. See the, the, Where do they fuck? They the, come through this door or something. The problem shit. with the Death Note is, like, I, I feel like no matter how virtuous you are, like, and you're like, you're saying, like, oh, I'm gonna... It's about just, whether or not the benefit outweighs the... No, 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 but also, you can become corrupt. You have power. Yes. It can change you. Uh, it, it starts with, like, all these corporate heads, then all of a sudden, it turns into, like... The fucking guy who like hit your car and like ran away. You got. I would space never and... do something like that. It's like it used to I find like that the whole. I don't know. You you say I'm saying you that say it's that. possible to dev like you have all this power. Literally, no one can touch you, and it's like I don't know. The same the same exact uh, psychological conditions exist with like fame and money and like any kind of power that one could have. Oh fuck, I totally dodged it. I totally dodged it. I hate the tit hit detection. That same thing right. exists. Sorry? You should have kept going right. I don't understand it. Whatever. The same, the exact same psychological condition exists no matter what kind of power it is, whether it's being able to murder somebody or you have influence and fame, you know? And I feel like I've gained a lot of influential power over the years and I haven't turned into an asshole. I haven't, I haven't turned in, you know, like, I'm, I'm still, I'm not, I haven't done it, I, I haven't started to do anything, like, immoral or anything, even though I could have the opportunity to, and I could get away with it, you know, like, I, I, I don't, you know, I don't have a link for audible.com at the end of every single one of my videos, even though that's not really an immoral thing, you know, I still have some sense of integrity, I don't think that I, I lost any of that. Some people are able to keep they're cool, you know. Even if it's not necessarily the norm, I feel like I feel like I have an, enough of a level head in that respect of just having a moral framework that I could probably still be okay without. Oh fuck! Like, where did they come from behind me that their bullets reached me that quickly? Fuck. I'm just saying that, like, the the thing about that and what's scary is the su the change can be so subtle that you wouldn't even notice. Have I changed? I'm not saying. I don't know. I I've known you for three two days. I've I've known you for what three four years I think three years in person too. I I I couldn't say, and I don't think you have. Like, there's nothing about no. There's nothing I could really honestly say that I like. I've noticed that's changed about you in any way. Yeah, I mean, but that, like, again, it's it's. Um, I'm just saying that like that, that that's kind of what's scary about it is like give a man power and you'll see his true character and everything. It's, uh, yeah, like I, I just feel like myself as an individual would be okay just based on me knowing myself alone. Yeah, you know, I I'm in a position where I could probably be like taking advantage of you work wise, and I think that like. I guess you don't really have to say this, say your thoughts on this on stream, but I, I think that I'm a fair, like, em employer, if you want to call it that. Like, I think, you know, I think that I'm I'm being really fair and reasonable, even though I'm in a position <laughs> where like, I, I probably could be being really, you know, unethical and unreasonable. I think that I'm... Well, 
for okay, if I have to, if I have to make a, uh, if I have to cr criticize you there, it's uh, there's no wacky shirt Fridays. Ah, uh, and I can't. Damn admit, it. Well, I I'm sorry. Those are like, banned. You fucked up. You dropped the ball. <laughs> well, those are banned because uh, I find it offensive, and I don't think that uh, our company should be representing any kind of wacky shirts. Okay, there's a strict dress code in this house, and you're not allowed to leave. <laughs> I want to see that fucking shirt. Like just like perfect and straight, and I, I I like not not a single hair missing from the seams. Like, all right, ah! red from the street. Like, I don't know, that'd be funny if there was like this really strict dress code. You're like, you can you can live here and you can work here. Ah oh, no, please! Oh fuck! You gotta be in a fucking suit and tie every day. Oh no! Oh, why did you shoot? Why I did. did you shoot? I did. So okay, here's another mechanic that pisses me off. That is the reason why that killed me right there. So. Pulling the trigger and throwing things makes time move forward. Uh, well, if you wait, 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 wait. Kay. I'm not done. So if you if you click and there's so if I click the mouse right now, that also makes time go forward. So I didn't realize that I hadn't finished reloading and I was literally trying to shoot him, but despite the fact that I was unable to shoot him, and and bullets like there like I I guess I hadn't reloaded. Despite that, it made time go forward as though I did shoot him, except no bullet came out. So I didn't even move. His bullet came at me because I clicked on the mouse. See, look at this. Click, click, click. See, yeah, I'm not it, even moving. Yeah, I no, hate that. I think that that's fucking stupid. No, that's a consequence to your actions. So you like. I was trying to shoot him because I thought that it, I had like the think, gun had reloaded all the way, and then he just of it shot is me. It's like it was real so time bullshit. strategy in first person. That so sucks. every every choice, every decision you make is gonna take up time, which is a a resource. It's, uh, there's consequences to literally every single action that you take in this game. So, with every click, with every throw, with every pickup, with every shot, you're losing time. Oh my god, where did that come? Where did you come from? <laughs> uh, by the way, somebody keeps asking about Aeon Flux. I, the movie's shit, the cartoon is okay. That's all I have to say. It just, the cartoon like, seemed cool. The, the, you, I think you'd really like the cartoon, but like the story, anime. but story-wise, it's just okay. Anime is cartoons. <laughs> it's nothing more. PS3 has no games. Anime is real life. Mark, do you know any good horror anime? Fuck. Uh, no. Wow. Ugh. I don't think I know any horror anime. It's like I know, like I know anime that has horrible things happen in it. But nothing horror wise. So I guess the sound effect lets me know. Yeah. And that's how I should be treating it. Ah! Oh! Throw. Um. Oh my god, this game is in time. Time is money, Adam. Don't oh, fuck! Have you ever seen or read the Book Thief? No, I don't give a fuck about the Book Thief. Ooh, wow, 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 I'm a little... Sorry, I don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, Love Exposure, have you ever seen it? I think I saw a bit of it, and I didn't finish it because I had too many other movies to watch, and it didn't seem like it was going to be an amazing, fantastic 10 out of 10. I think this guy's the last one. Um, a really scary anime is Naruto. It's fuck. scary that it's still fucking on. Why hasn't it ended? Why is nobody? Why? Why is it still going? Who? Who? Who cares? Oh yeah, perfect blue. That's a psychological horror. Yeah, you're right. Um. Oh my god. Oh um, my god, that was so difficult. You know what? It, that was it's so difficult. Yeah. Fuck. I, I feel like I feel like I've seen plenty of horror anime, but nothing's coming to mind. I'm sorry. I, I just like I sometimes I draw a blank. More Zootopia porn. All right. Sorry. Sorry, boys. Oops. Well. Ah! I just have to look at their heads, I guess. I've got the power. <laughs> wow.
game's not offering me any music, so I mean, you gotta do something. Okay. You are so much better when I'm able to control it from my keyboard <laughs> instead of like exiting out of the game yeah. every time. Alt tabbing. This is just a simulation. Oh, oh, Bobby boy, Bobby boy, Bobby boy, Bobby boy, Bobby boy. Um, there was uh, an indie. Actually, I don't know if it was indie. Uh, there was a game for the Wii made in Japan that had was in interesting. It was called like White Valentine. And I actually, I would love to see that done better, maybe, or maybe even like a film form. I thought like, or an anime, I don't know. Like I thought it had a very interesting idea. Oh, Whee! I go! Wee -wee 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 -wee. Oh, okay. I got it. <laughs> I thought he was about to say my body is ready. <laughs> Uploading. Oh, fuck. I like this ending. <gasps> no. 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 No, 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 no. This is interesting. It's always going to be at the back of his head, too. <laughs> it's so funny. Oh. <laughs> I kind of just ruined the immersion or the, the cinematic effect, but whatever. Endless mode unlocked. Oh, cool. Thanks. Thanks. I didn't like my boggy anyways. Super hot. hot. Super hot. Does that mean I beat the game hand over? What? Oh, I get it. I did it. Okay, yeah. that was fun. Yeah, that was a good... That was interesting, yeah. Yeah, that was a seven. See? Like, see? a bit obnoxious at times, but... Yeah. Oh, 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 I finished the tutorial? I don't think so. We'll find out, I guess. There might be something after the credits. Which I think somebody told me there's something after the credits. Alright, right, back, back. Oh, arrows? I don't care about you guys. There's no way that there's this many. Really? Oh, these are all the backers, probably. I think it did have a Kickstarter thing. Oi, 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 oi. Trying to make it so that there's no content ID. Yeah, 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 yeah. Zizzy Zang. Zim35. Ah, and transmission. And transmission. It says press escape to skip, but I almost don't want to. Oh, whatever. Oh, you're Blaine. Ow. Why should I give you the ability to mod people? I don't get it. I keep saying that Why? all day. All and all Why, night. Kirby? Like, what? How would I benefit from that? Google gobble. One of us. One of us. <laughs> ah. Any more? Give us your friends. Give us your name. Give us names. Because it would be funny. Ugh, no. <laughs> it's the most innovative. <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> ah, that's so good. I think somebody actually. That was one of the reviews. That, I think that was actually one of the one of the reviews for it too. Actually, Super Bunny Hop started his review with that. It's the most innovator sh innovative That's so shooter funny. ever. That's hilarious, actually. The Obey. See, this is like indie game done right. Yeah, it's a seven. 
<laughs> so endless mode is just like waves or whatever. Yeah. Play challenges, train from the upcoming, spread and promote the game. It's funny. Yeah. It's cle it's clever. I like the gameplay. Started style. out a little weak. Yeah. Killstagram. Get the work. Ah! Recruit. Probably like links it with my Facebook or something. I don't know. Maybe. Oh my god. Killstagram. Yeah, it just opened a link in Chrome, but I don't really feel like. I don't really feel like doing this. Endless. So levels is the shit that I already did. Endless. Challenges. What is challenges? Locked. Interesting. Can you do me a favor and grab that um, white remote for the air conditioner that's on my like desk over the side table to my bed? Mm -hmm. Thank you. I'm getting kind of warm. I can't even punch people. It's probably part of the challenge. Thank you. Beep. Sub hype. Mark's a racist. Ow! Who sub? Who sub? Who sub? Who did sub? Let's see. Let's see. Let me see. Ashlesh, AJ Schlesinger, eighteen. Why? Thank you very much. Ah, you baby boy. What? Zootopia is not an adult animated furry movie. It pandered towards adults, like furries. It pandered towards furries, but it's not an adult movie at all. Don't you mean it pandered? Fuck off. To <laughs> God, come on! Eh, baby I guess I boy. have to use the sword, and that's part of this. Hmm. Katanom oh, katana only. Oh, shit, I didn't even read that properly. If I just read it, I would have understood it very well. Katana only. Jesus. I don't want to do Tales for the Borderlands. That sounds so shitty. Looks like garbage. Super. Wait. Polyamory? What is that again? It's like open relationships or something? I don't even get a gun. Oh, so Katana, these are the same... Are these the same levels as... Are these so the same I, levels as before? So. so now it's like the entire challenge... This is the challenge of doing the entire game again with a katana only? Wow. It's gonna just go through every level like it did before, except now katana only? I think that's what it, that's what's happening. Yes, maybe. That's so funny. Oh, and it gives me the time the time it took to, to do it also. That's cool. I don't wanna do the whole game again with katana only, like maybe I'll do it at some point. But Yeah, I knew I recognized Layers of Fear before it was its full game, and it was a, it was a beta, and I remember You're a beta. two best friends playing it for their uh, shitstorm. It's weird that people were excited for it, because it's like, what could it, what could it have, like, if it was a worse version of what we played, what could it have shown that made people want to play it? It, it, I think just it's the, the fact like, that they said it's a concept. I think it's because not many people played Antichamber and the reality warping. The like, oh, I just went through this door and what's behind me changed. I think that that really impressed people because they might not have, they might not have, you know, known that how much of a ripoff that is anyway. They might have thought like, oh wow, what a cool, interesting, unique concept. That I mean, already was kind of done in PT anyway. But I mean. Antichamber did it so much better. Antichamber did it a million times better. Yeah, I think it's also, like I said, it's chat just the simulator fact that Sorry. Pe 
people thought that uh, they kept saying this isn't a finished product. It's gonna get better, guys. We're gonna fix all these problems. And it's like people just assumed, oh wow, this will be amazing. It like this is a concept for something better. Like, but then. Eh. Hey, hey, so endless is just what, enemies forever. Is that what's happening? Oh, okay. So it's how many I can kill. Most innovative shooter in years. Yeah, I'm not joining that train. Why not? Because <laughs> it's a forced meme. It's like the cake is a lie now, you know? Yeah. Let's do it. Let's be the meme. Don't shy I'll be the meme. From the meme, meme. In, stand in my meme, meme boy meme. stance. I meme the boy. Memeing in my meme boy stance. Stop. <laughs> stop. You stop. Stop. Fucking. I have good authority to realize that, to realize that Dad Cruz is a lizard person. I would say that's a reasonable assumption to make. You can see it in his lizard eyes. Ah! What's up? Did I beat the campaign yet? Yeah, I did. I mean, otherwise it wouldn't give me this option. Campaign for this? I mean, like, what else was were we talking about? Nothing. Oh, grade. A under A. Is he here? Somebody like mess. Oh, he is here. Oh my god. Yeah, Brady hey. Andre. What's, What's up? up? I, for I me. forgot that we modded each other. I've, I've, <laughs> I've, uh, I, I've been, uh, not regularly checking out your streams, but I've popped in here and there. You don't even know I've popped in enough to know that your voice sounds radically different than your actual videos. Mm. It might uh -huh. just also be the microphone and whether or not you're yelling. I guess people would probably say that about me, too. Um, Happy 1 million subs, even though I know you hit that a while back. Yeah. I think you should check out uh, Death Note, though. Uh, that I should check out Death Note? Grade A under A. Yes, oh. Adam, you oh, should check out Oh, he said that he... Death well, no, I mean, like... Did he say that he hasn't? Is this, <laughs> he doesn't even know what it is. It's an anime. Oh, fuck. It's Jesus! Well it just written. came out on Blu-ray. You can see it in supremo quality. Fuck, this. Fuck everything. Christ. Oh, I guess I do sound the same. Personal. I don't know if I want to just keep doing. Adam, this you're, endless mode. you're. What happened? You're the same. <laughs> You've changed, man. You haven't changed, man. <laughs> well. Wow. I'll, I'll change my clothes when I feel like it. <laughs> yeah. Adam should play. Resident Evil Zero. Yeah, we should we should go through the Resident Evil games. Well, they're coming out with the HD uh, four, five, and six. Yeah, apparently. you know what I don't like about that? What is that? They're releasing them at different times. I wish that they all released them at once. Because the way that they're releasing them is that the four is getting released last, and six is getting released first. So I would love to play them in order, while the games are still new. But then it's like, no, I have to make a decision of whether or not I want to play them new and possibly get you know, more attention on Twitch from playing a new game or playing them in order. I would love for it to just be both. I wish that they would have that they would have decided that the fourth one would be released first and then fifth and then sixth. I don't understand. Oi. Hop, 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 hop. Grade Adam under Adam. That sounds like a porn. Sounds like my kind of porn. I don't tell him to give shout outs. That's weird. Who's what? What? Oh, so, no, just one of the commenters, like, give Adam a shout out and let him know. Oh, whatever. It's like, eh, hey, don't force it. Yeah. If it's like, if it's if related it's relevant, to the topic, I, I, right. I understand then, but it's like, if I made, if, if I made a video and at the end I was like, also, watch this person. And it sounds no. It's, if it's related I do. To I topic, I give yeah. shout outs to uh, every frame of painting whenever he has a video out that's related to what I'm talking. Yeah, exactly. About. That's that's why. That's what's the part. Plus, I actually really related like his videos. Yeah. I'm a shill. You know who I, I do recommend? it for the shillings. Is that why they call them shills? Yes. That's funny. I never connected. No, I that don't until know. Just... I'm making that I up. feel like it would be. I feel like I yeah. feel like Maybe. saying someone's a shill is probably related. It could be slang. It could shilling. be 
It could have that meaning that you're talking about. It could. Oh, oh. new record. I think that's the new record noise. Otherwise, maybe it just exploded my computer. Shut his gun out of your hands. Fuck you. I want it. Koopa I... Oh, somebody's asking me. A... Ah. Two and three ain't good. Get what's I are gonna what? get remastered? Oh, yeah. Okay, no, they've talked about two getting remastered. For what? Uh, Resident Evil. Oh. Because I'm pretty sure what. Uh... Didn't you say two was good? Two is considered by fans to be the best original game. So one is like a joke. It's it started it started it right. Uh, two was the mwah, the magnum opus, the masterpiece. Uh, three was what was a lot of people considered a carbon copy of two. But Ow. I loved it because you got to play is not only Jill, but uh, I love the character of Nemesis, and it added this really crazy dynamic to the game, which a lot of other games w never had done before, where there was a a con constant, relentless villain chasing you always, and it added a whole new level of like tension and horror to the game. Uh, like this like unstoppable creature would pop up at any moment and get you. I was about oh VR. What the fuck? Can you do it? Should. Can you hook up VR? What the hell? What the? What is happening? What is happening right now? What is this? <laughs> oh my god. What the fuck is happening? Where am I? Where it's am I? It's not controlling the way that I expected it to. Okay, I don't know what I just did. What the right. hell? Q. Remember when Becky was pounding on your door yelling for you to open it and what did you talk about? I'm not gonna... Oh, no worries. No worries, Great A. I always... Sorry if I'm interrupting you. I was trying to... I was thinking of addressing uh, this before, but I just didn't get a chance for a second because you were talking about Resident Evil. Um, I was about to say to Great A that uh, I also show up in other people's chats and then become <laughs> self-conscious about whether or not I'm taking up the chat and being like, ah... Don't want to make this about me, but yeah, don't worry about it. You can talk about yourself in chat; it doesn't matter. Like this, is, this people chat want to talk is, about it. Like yeah. this is the most lax chat you will ever find like, on anyone's Twitch stream. It's very under moderated anything. too. The mods are only there to stop spam. Yeah. Anyway, sorry. What were you saying? Um, no, no. It's uh, Dank Link was trying to get me to do a story, but I don't know if I want to do a story right now. <laughs> okay. I love yeah, you, Dank you Link. <laughs> Chop left, chop right. Oh, what the fuck? You idiot. I didn't know. Well, I don't. Not <laughs> the most clear. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, chop, chop. This, this is, is funny. 10 out of 10 fuck. game. I'm dumb. You're dead. Oops. <laughs> Oops. Faster, ah. faster, 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 faster. Fasa, 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 fasa. Oh, baby. Real game right here. Woo! Yo, hey, step it up. You're too slow. <laughs> Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. Yeah, uh-uh. Chili dogs, step it up. Suck my dick. Ah, oh. too fast. Dead dude, tree dude, dead dude. Oh, we did it. This is weird. Amazing. Scroll. Oh, naked gun movies? Yeah. Yeah, those are good. I haven't seen them in a long time. <laughs> you have to check out this game. I want new game. I want. It is called Shrill. <laughs> okay. This weird. This is really weird. I don't know. Con was <laughs> now awesome. Rectagon. Ah, oh, I wanted to. I wanted to rectagon. Okay, whatever. Yeah, let's say Nielsen died a long time ago. What is this? Ah, oh, whatever. I'll do this. Uh, oh, piracy protection. Fuck you! Why'd you get an unregistered copy, Adam? Uh, page. Do I have to look at page ten, like, for real? What is this? Oh, I don't want to. I want to skip this shit. 
Oh, come on. Can I actually play the game, or is it just like is a simulator of me having a pirated copy of a game? That's great. <laughs> Let me skip this shit. What is my favorite game? Um, the Witness. Halo and Mass Effect and the Odd World first two games. Mm. Mine's Okami. Okay, let's cares. see. Ah! <laughs> Sorry. Um, so page 10 of something. Choo choo. What? Archive. My files? Like. Uh, what I can't really do anything other than that, can I? If Adam rated a movie I made a six out of ten, um, I'd want like I wouldn't I be offended. Want to strangle you? I, I would. I would ask him why, though. Mister Host what, what lives. Makes it a six out of 10? Thank you for subscribing. I feel like I feel like there's no way to do this because it just it types whatever it wants for you, right? Oh, sub hype. Page ten. Uh, oh, yeah, I already said it. Don't worry, I'm on it. Mark. <laughs> Slowpoke over here. Page 10. Slow bro. Read me? Is that it? Like, I don't know if it's possible. Ah, whatever. I think I'm done with this game. Let's start Mass Effect 2. Okay. You down for some Mass Effect 2? I guess. Videos! Yes. Garrus Simulator? Garrus Relationship Simulator 20... When did Mass Effect 2 come out? Like 2010? 2009? 2010? 2012? 2014? No. Um, I like how it's a pixelated version of the trailer. I like how it is literally the trailer, but just like the shittiest resolution you could see it in. That's so funny. Weird. These oh, my people YouTube are completely fine. This is cool. They are just enjoying a new exciting video game. Video games have been scientifically proven to improve problem solving and motor skills, <laughs> spatial awareness, social skills, and stress control. Help! Although it takes just 10 seconds to play. play. This game brings uh, endless <laughs> competitive entertainment to you, your, your family, and your friends. And the best part is, this game is available now for everyone to enjoy. All you need is a tele tele telephone and some cardboard. Tete -tete telephone. Oh, see, yeah, look. This is, uh, VR. And remember, play responsibly and don't mix with drugs. Uh, I want them to have this game in VR. They do. But they, what? They do. Like, they just talked about cardboard VR. Cardboard VR. You've never heard of that? No, I know what that is. I, like, it's just not what I would be looking for in VR. I'm sure. I would never want to do Google Adam, Cardboard. Like, I guarantee, like, this is available. Didn't Ethan and... make a video on, like, Google Cardboard, though? What? Ethan and Ela, they made a video on Google Cardboard? I didn't I watch the video, but I can only so. assume that they were talking about it being stupid. I don't know. Oh, whatever. Let's play some Ass Erect 2. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> Shutting down. Super hot. This is really funny. Use this. You can copy it. Haha. <laughs> copy paste. Hey. All right. Help. Wake me up. Hey, everybody. Can't wake up. I don't want to give him the right to mod people. Oh, Jesus. 238 people. That's decent. Um. How come I can never see the video here? Oh, there we go. Oh, man. That was a Life video of me when a poop egg fell on my pants. The, oh. <laughs> poop egg. All right. Um, I'm going to pause the stream just while I open it up, just because I have had issues before with audio not working if I just switch games. So I will be back in literally 40 seconds, and you can count if you want to. BRB. Goodbye. <laughs>